Hey ladies and gents, if you're watching this, if you're a guy. Anyway, this is my wig review on the MLC, um, MLC something. I don't, I don't remember what it is. I'm going to have to, um, put it in the description box. So this wig, um, has some really far back parting space. I don't know if you can see that. Um. And this is what she looks like on the mannequin. Kind of lopsided right now. This is what she looks like on the mannequin. Really cute. Now, she has this really weird spot in the back that just is not cute. Um, and you're going to see when I put it on. I'm not going to put on a wig cap because I'm just a lazy bum. And we'll see how I can get this to work. thought I had a hairpin somewhere in here, so I always have them randomly everywhere, but apparently not. So she actually has two combs in the, one comb in the back. Uh, oddly enough, only one comb in the front. Um, adjustable straps, and she is in a num color number two. And this is newborn free that's what it is newborn free magic lace front and I, I don't remember the, the number um the hair is very much like relaxed hair so it's not like it's soft but it's not like um silky silky straight which i feel like is unrealistic for for me um because i don't have silky straight hair unless i flat iron the heck out of my hair which only has a very short time span that it stays silky straight. Anyway, it might look weird because I have the hump of, um, have my hair hump in the back. Hopefully I don't got any pieces of hair sticking out. So anyway, I didn't adjust the straps at all. So this is what she looks like. I don't like it when it's like super, super neat. I feel like this is a hairstyle that for the most part is funky, edgy. Anyway, so this is her newborn free magic lace front. I like this. I will probably do a little bit of layering right through there. But there's like this spot that always sticks up like right there. That's what makes it look fake. I don't like that. I don't understand what the deal is. And it's just that side. This side doesn't do it. Anyway, so the first, I decided to get this one in a black because wasn't really sure, you know, what it was going to look like, um, whether or not the edges were going to look good. Um, it does blend it easier you know with my hair being a dark color although it does look just a little bit weird because my hair is not quite this dark um, so I worry sometimes about it just it looking kind of off my edges being a little lighter but it looks you know I think it looks relatively realistic for a, a bob um, I think it's really cute um, I think I would want to get some um, get one of these in color. In fact, I'm going to get one in the Bobby Boss collection. It's in a copper red. And I think it's going to be really pretty because I have a if you if you checked out my reviews, I have another review of the Bobby uh, Bobby Boss wig that's kind of it's like a a funky cut. It's kind of angled but not quite as drastic. It, one side is not longer than the other, but it's more layered all the way through the back, and it's really cute. It's really cute. I like it. I got a lot of compliments on it. Um, the color is just banging. It's a, a red that actually matches my skin complexion. So anyway, this is what the hairline looks like. Again, I haven't done any type of playing around with it. Um, this is what the parting looks like. Right here. Um, nice wig. Very nice wig. Um, so that's it. Tell me what you guys think. If you like it. If you don't. Um... And that's it. That's my review of this wig. Mag Magic Lace Front Newborn Free 
don't remember the number one fifty six or something like that. It's the ankle bob. You'll be able to see it um, if you were to search that that particular wig. Anyway, stay tuned for more reviews.